Alright guys, welcome back. Game of Thrones Season 6 Episode 4. And now that I'm back off holiday, we are blasting again through this series. Uh, after last episode, I cannot wait to just dive straight into this one. So without further ado, if you go on to enjoy this video, make sure to go down there, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button. As you know, we're trying to hit a thousand subscribers by the end of summer. We can do it. You guys can do it. So come on, hit that button down there. And if you want to see the full length reaction to this and all my other videos, then my Patreon link will also be in the description below. And without further ado, let's get into Game of Thrones Season 6, Episode 4. Well, guys, last episode, like, not a lot of action happened, but we got a lot of exposition dump. So, obviously, the main events, Arya's sight has been returned by Jacken after she finally won the fight against the woman. And I'm pretty sure that woman is ended up on Arya's list. Because the woman was like, is there anyone else? Are you sure there's no one else? We also had Daenerys. She went to the place for Cal's Widows. And they were like, oh, this is the best place you can end up. Tommen finally was like, oh, yes, yes, yes. Um, do something against the High Sparrow. And then he just didn't. Obviously, the main part of the episode, the mutineers that betrayed Jon Snow all got hanged to death, including Ollie. Like, I am so surprised he hung Ollie. Obviously, Sir Alistair, yes, dead, die, I don't care. But Ollie, I cannot believe John actually went through with that. And I can't wait to see the aftermath of everything in this episode. Oh, shit, yeah, this happened as well, did it? That's how the episode ended. Jon Snow has left the Night's Watch. Like, he just walked out. What are you gonna do? Get warm? <laughs> yeah, to be fair, he's been stuck at the wall for so long. I bet he's absolutely freezing. We saw what's out there. And John's gonna go fight it all. I did everything I could, you know. You swore a vow. I, I pledge my life to the Night's Watch. I that is true, to be fair, John. Open the gate! Oh my god, yes! Yes, 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 Sansa! Sansa's gonna see John! Yes, 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 yes! Oh my god, I've never been so happy to see someone at these gates. <laughs> Which means, for them to stay, Jon Snow needs to lead the Night's Watch again. <laughs> yes! Come on, this reunion. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god, Jesus Christ. It's making me tear up already. We're only three minutes into the episode. Oh my god, Sansa's finally got some good luck. We never should have left Winterfell. No, you really shouldn't. I want to scream at myself, don't go, you idiot. Yeah, to be fair, after Joffrey and Ramsay and everyone, Jesus Christ. I wish I could change everything. We were children. I was awful, just admit it. <laughs> Well, yeah, but you've grown up now, Sansa. I want John to meet Arya. Like, John, Arya, and Sansa are the, like, I don't really care about Bran and Rick, I'm not gonna lie. Where will you go? Where will we go? Hey! Oh my god! Is, 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 oh my god, is John gonna go with Brienne? And Pod? And Sansa? There's only one place we can go. Not back to bloody King's Landing. Home. Or should we tell the Boltons to pack up and leave? We'll take yes. it back from them. Yes, we will! Come on! Take all the wildlings, take the giants, take all everything! It's all I've done since I left home. It's all Sansa's done as well. It's all Bran's done, it's all Rickon's done, it's all Rob did. And I lost. Yeah, but now it's time to win. The only way you can go now is up. But I'll do it myself if I have to. Oh my god, go on, go kill Ramsay, I cannot wait. Will you stay here at Castle Black? Nah, she's gone. I will do as Jon Snow commands. Really? Why? Why? Why does she serve Jon Snow? There's something suspicious about him. What happened down there? Yeah, you need to tell him. You need to tell him about Princess Shireen. I saw Stannis' forces defeated in the field. My lady, I'm... No, Stannis burned her at the stake. Before Renly was assassinated with blood magic. 
Oh yeah, that 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 was from her. Doesn't mean I forget or forgive. Oh my God, Jesus Christ! No, 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 no! I I don't want them to die by Brienne. Stannis, just before I executed him. We we actually know that he's dead now, then, because we never actually got to see it. I wanted to see Stannis die. Oh God, don't tell me Baelish is back. Jesus, we haven't seen him in so long. The defender of the Vale. Hey, hello. Jesus, Aiden Gillen's back in the show. We haven't seen him in like, I'd say probably a full season now. And yet not long ago, we received reports that she has been married to Ramsay Bolton in Winterfell. On our yes, that is very true. How many people knew of my travel plans with Sansa Stark? He's just betraying everyone. Slander a man in his own home, you might find yourself crossing swords with him. Are you kidding me? Are you actually kidding me? This guy, the, the Lord of the Vale, is going to kill this guy for Peter. Oh my God. Should we throw him through the moon door? <laughs> oh my God. Oh my God. He's enjoyed a distinguished military career. You God, he's talking in the past tense. Enjoyed. We should help her. That was my instinct as well. Oh God. Then we definitely shouldn't. No, 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 we, no, no. Time has come to join the fray. No, no, no. Oh my God. I hate this man. Please kill him. Kill him. We enter these negotiations with open eyes. Yeah, there's no way Tyrion's getting murdered by some unnamed masters of Yunkai or Astapor. Somehow, you've risen to the top of the Great Pyramid of Meereen. Yeah, of course he has. He's Tyrion Lannister, mate. But she will give the other cities of Slaver's Bay time to adjust to the new order. What does that mean? Wait, what? yeah, what does that mean, Tyrion? We will give you seven years to end the practice. We will cut off your support for the Sons of the Harpy. We do not support the Sons of the Harpy. Fine, fine. Bollocks. Like, yeah. You will not receive a better offer. Nah, I should have been five years, not seven. See if it doesn't taste every bit as good as what came before. Go on then, you can do it. I hope they agree to this. It's quite a good deal on their half, to be fair. Our brothers and sisters died fighting these scum. Now you invite them to our city and drink wine with them. Yeah, because we need to reason with them. We need to actually make it better for everyone. Until she returns from her travel. When does she return? I don't know. She's kind of been captured by um, all the uh, ex-cows. Uh, Grey Worm's going to mess up the deal, isn't he? Oh, God. Daenerys is going to come back to Tyrion in chains. You are my enemy. I am not betraying her work. I am trying to save her city. You promised the slavers they could keep slavery. For a short time. Seven years is not a Yeah, to be fair, Tyrion, seven years is not short. They'll underestimate us every time, and we will use that to our advantage. You will not use them. They will use you. Are you sure? This is Tyrion Lannister you're talking to. He can do anything with his mouth. That came out very strange, but I meant speaking, not... Do you think these two are actually ever going to find Daenerys? Like, because she's not actually with the uh, Dothraki anymore, is she? If I win, I'm the shit who killed an old man. If I lose, I'm the shit who was killed by an old man. You would lose, mate. I don't like this character at all. I love Jorah. Carl Drogo Dash was supposed to come here and join the Dosh Kaleen. Oh, they are at the right place then. The Temple of the Dosh Kaleen. Yeah, so yeah, it's there in the centre. Okay, are they gonna break her out? There's a hundred thousand of them down there. We can't fight our way out. We wait till dark, and then we'll find her. Come on, I hope they get Daenerys back. Hope Drogon comes and just rides them all back. Very attacked. Oh no, no, he, he's, he's gonna see the grayscale. Told ya. Oh God. You know what happens? I know what happens. He's gonna... Oh, God, no. Jorah's dying this episode, isn't he? This guy isn't gonna hide his knife and Jorah's dying this episode. <laughs> Honestly, I'll put money on that that guy still has his knife on us. They're gonna see it and he's gonna... And Jorah's gonna sacrifice himself. Oh, I can't be bothered. Yeti how, 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 how do you know that? <laughs> 
Jesus, how's Joe getting defeated this easy? Should have brought the swords to be fair, if the first people you see is going to turn you in anyway. Jesus. Okay, Diana Harris is going to come save Jorah then. Are they just going to kick down the door and be like, Danele Storborn? Keep your cash, Shatalaya Farmai. See, Carl Drogo, he, like, he wasn't really a nice man, but at least he was nice to Daenerys and stuff. Are you kidding? You can't leave that place until you die. We will never get out of face Dothrak alive. All we can do is try. Yeah, might as well. We can do more than that. And you're going to help me. But well, obviously, that's the reason they're here, Daenerys. Like, honestly. <coughs> Are we getting Marjorie's trial, finally? Oh, God, it's the atonement room. Is she going to have to do a uh, walk of shame like Cersei? But for you, that means seeking out money, finery, power. That is true, to be fair. She, she kind of... Um, did manipulate the king. My father was a cobbler. He died when I was young and I took over his shop. It's so weird to think that she was the same woman that was like engaged to Renly Baratheon like four seasons ago. That's just mad. Everyone else was asleep on the couches or on the floor. What is the point in this story? Like, can we just kill this guy? He's not like, he's like the villain of the season. Well, except the Night King or whatever the White Walker King is called. I think it's the Night King. The story I was telling myself about who I was. Yeah. A collection of lies that would disappear in the light. Do you think Marjorie's actually going to confess? She hasn't even done anything. All she did was lie for her brother. Like, that is why she's in this cage. Let's go and see him. Who? Hey. Your brother. Yeah, I was going to say, what do you mean, who? The guy you've literally been asking to see. No oh, God. Well, he's been tortured a lot more than her. Like, uh, they, surely they're both dying soon. Not that you don't care. I just want it to stop. It will. You just have to hold out a bit longer, Loris. Just make it stop. Please. Oh, no, 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 no. He's going to die. Loris is going to die. Marjorie's going to confess to save him. Like, because she knows that he just wants to die at this point. I am advising the king on our current predicament. Well, are you the hand of the king? You need to be careful in dealing with such a man. To prevent things from escalating any further. I, I don't get why they can't just assassinate him. Queens must command respect. Kings even more so. Not just for their own... Wasn't the High Sparrow the one that Cersei, like, not employed? but told to go after Laura Savage, then she ended up getting arrested herself. If he found out a whole reach of confidence, which he would not take lightly, given his constant prattling about the truth. <laughs> yeah, that is true, to be fair. Wait, what did he say that you're going to tell her? I've forgotten. Because he understood the necessity of working with one's rivals. My dear. Oh, yeah. you have been... she, she's just... Oh, my God. I feel like Elena's going to confess to Joffrey's murder, like, soon. You've got the second largest army in Westeros. You'll bring them into the city. Stop Queen Marjorie's humiliation before it starts. What? Well, yeah, well, oh, they're just lying. Like, she she never has a walk of atonement. Were you expressly forbidden from standing down? No. There you are, then. I, I, I don't like this man at all. Like, the hand of the king. I don't even know who he is. And stand aside. And let the people that took him from you be destroyed. Oh my god, okay. Come on, go kill them all. Go kill every single one, especially the High Sparrow. We'll have civil war. Many will die. Many okay. will die no matter what we do. Better them than us. <laughs> okay, Elena's on board with all the mass execution. Of course she is. She's, she's a psycho. But a nice psycho. She killed Joffrey. It's Theon going home. He actually is. He's going back to the Iron Islands. And he's going to be met with the truth that his dad's dead. I can't hear you. I escaped. 
Well, I miss confidence, Theon. Like, I genuinely miss how he was in season one and two. Uh, it was so fun. No, no, I only heard he died after we docked. You happened to show up on Pike right before the King's move. I didn't know. Yeah, so what's gonna happen? Is Theon, like, is Theon gonna be the king? Oh, God. I forgot about this. Yes, yes, yes. Ramsay's captured Rickon and Osha. They yeah. put me in chains and put a sword at my throat. So I served them. The Starks. Oh, here we go. Yeah, here we go. She's gonna try play Ramsay like she played Theon. Same thing men always want. I mean, they really want it. They give it a bath first. Um, I don't... Uh, no, no, no. That's just not true. Ramsay's gonna kill her. Like, Ramsay isn't like other men. He just kind of kills people. Not so. I had to work hard to get him talking. <laughs> yeah, and this is exactly what he d she did to Theon. He told me everything. Oh, God, no. Everything about her. Boys and who helped them escape. And oh, how God. She did it. Oh, God. <laughs> For God's sake, Ramsay! When is there going to be an episode where you don't murder everyone? Oh, for f So, okay, Hush is dead. You can go back to carving your stupid apple. Okay. Why? 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 Why are the Boltons bringing a white flag to anyone? To the traitor Ambassador Jon Snow. You allowed thousands of wildlings past the wall. You have betrayed oh. your own kind. You've if this is from Ramsay. Your brother Rickon is in my dungeon. Oh, God. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So he's realised he has a reason to go now! Keep her from me and I will ride north and slaughter every wildling man, woman and babe living on Jesus Christ almighty! You will watch as my soldiers take turns raping your sister. What the f- What?! Oh, I am off to bloody kill Ramsay! I hate this man! Then I will spoon your eyes from their sockets and let my dogs do the rest. Come and see. He's a Ramsay psycho. Bolton, Lord of Winterfell. It's like, honestly, he signs all that. He's like, oh yeah, I'll murder your entire family. I'll spoon your eyes out. Yours sincerely, Ramsay Bolton. How many do you have that can march and fight? 2,000. 2,000? Plus the, like, 80 at the wall? You're the son of the last true Warden of the North. Northern families are loyal. They'll fight for you if you ask. That is true, John. Come on! Come on! A monster... <laughs> has taken our home and our brother. I think he's the step above a monster. Like, what is the step above a monster? But Ramsay is it. Jesus, why? Like, why? Can we, can we please? Just save Daenerys. I can't, like, all the storylines are so bad. I, I don't know if I'm the only one that doesn't really like her storylines. Except, her, like, her in season one with Jason Momoa as... Cal Drogo, like that was a good storyline for Daenerys. Since then, it's just been a bit boring. So, how are Jora and Dario Naharis getting out of this one? Like, there's about five minutes left of the episode. I don't really know how they're saving Daenerys. Oh, Jesus, 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 okay. And I was a Um this is Daenerys Targaryen. She has a voice everywhere. She's a rightful king. Yeah. It's where she was like Rego. Is she gonna try to use these people? Like, to get back the Iron Throne. Yeah, you think you're too small, mate. You're just little men. You need to go fight in the Seven Kingdoms. Fight for Daenerys. Oh, yeah, you think Jorah's going to let that happen? Oh, yeah, she's immune to fire, isn't she? Oh, 
my god! Okay, Daenerys, come on! Don't mess with the Targaryen then! <laughs> you all die, mate! You all die! <laughs> Fair enough, Daenerys! I don't really know how you're getting out of all these people, though. Like, as you said, there's a hundred thousand people ready to kill you. Are you gonna try command them all? Oh, she's gonna walk through the fire, isn't she? I swear, if she's naked again. I'm pretty sure she's naked. Oh my god, they're all kneeling again! They're literally all kneeling for her again! And now she's back! She's got the Dothraki army again! Now she can fight everyone! Oh my god, Jesus Christ, okay! Go on, kneel! There you are. Get back in line. So, we have a full Dothraki army now. Is that how we end off? Of course that's how we end off. What a way to end the episode. Like, what a great episode. Well, guys, that is Game of Thrones Season 6, Episode 4 completed. And compared to last episode, this episode was miles above so much got, oh my god so much happened like even if all this hadn't happened at the end which was probably like one of the most insane parts of the episode so much happened jesus the episode basically started with sansa and brienne and pod made it back to the wall like they met john oh my god that that was such an emotional moment like it had me crying two minutes into the episode like Honestly, that, those were the best parts of this episode. We obviously got Theon. He finally went back to the Iron Island, uh, their, their islands, found out that his dad was dead and that Yara's in charge. And he said that he didn't want to be king and that he was just going to help Yara become queen of the Iron Islands, of Pike or whatever the hell it's called. We had the awful, awful, awful letter from Ramsay Bolton making him definitely a worse character than Joffrey. Like, he's, yeah, he's... He's a like this, this. This is Joffrey's level of psycho. Ramsay's like out of shots, like all the way up here. But oh my god, that letter! And so John is now gonna march on with oh, surely because Ramsay was like, oh yeah, I'm gonna kill everyone in your family. I've got Rickon. I've he didn't say he'd killed Orsha, but he killed Orsha. Like that is mad. Like yeah, I knew when he was like, oh yeah, Theon told me about the escape. I was like, yeah. There we are then. Yeah, <laughs> so she died. She didn't reach the knife in time. Actually, she did. She went like that, and then she got stabbed in the neck. And just that ending there. Oh, my God, with Daenerys. So Daenerys is now leading all the cows again. I don't, I've don't. forgotten how she didn't lead them before. We got another deal with Cersei and Jaime because um, they lied that Marjorie is going on a walk of atonement. And then Elena was like, nope, that is not happening, mate. We're killing all the High Sparrows men. So next episode, the High Sparrow is going bye-bye. 100% next episode. They're not going to drag it out for the full season. We have battles of Winterfell. We have other battles to find. And there's only like two and a half seasons left. So we have to get on that quick. Ramsay Bolton needs to go bye-bye. Oh, my God. And Daenerys needs to bloody sit on this Iron Throne. So if you guys did enjoy this video, make sure to go down there, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button. And if you guys, like, if you guys are excited for Jon Snow, go fight Winterfell, because I think that's what's going to happen. Then hit that like button, because I am so excited for that. And if you want to see the full length reaction to this and all my other videos, as I said at the start, my Patreon link will be in the description down below. And I will see you in the next video. Goodbye.